Welcome back everybody, we're here at Detailing.com once again. Today we're gonna to talk to you about coatings. We're gonna be working on this beautiful 911 uh, Porsche uh, that's been corrected. If any of you guys uh, checked in earlier, we were on Instagram Live, uh, you saw JC applying the uh, G-Technic Ultra. Uh, that's now on the vehicle, it's what it's wearing right now. I got JC with me back here, he's getting the XO V4, also known here in California, B4, right? So we're gonna be applying that to this vehicle, it's gonna be our final top coat. Also, for you guys either protecting or looking to have your clear bra protected, this whole front end, uh, lights, fenders, hood, bumper, mirrors, is all uh, clear bra. So we're gonna go ahead and apply XOV4 onto that clear bra. Excellent way to maintain and protect your clear bra uh, from you know either weathering or just not being as durable as you want it to be. So it's a great way either it fits for yourself, uh, have a professional detailer apply it, or for you pro guys out there, offer it to your customers who you know have clear bra or having clear bra installed. Uh, it works great. So without further ado, I'm gonna have JC start applying it. We're gonna give you some close-up shots and show you how that coating goes on to the clear bra, how we flash, when we wipe down, and all that good stuff. So hope you like it, stay tuned, check it out. So as you guys can see, JC put a good amount of that XOV4, got a good coat on there. Using the first towel to spread it around, get a good, nice uh, coverage on the entire surface. And then he's gonna go ahead and buff it in and make sure there's no high spots. All right guys, so with anything, especially with detailing, paint correction, ceramic coatings, you gotta have your trusty lights. So JC's even wearing a headlamp. We've got two other lights that are out, one behind me here, one up front. We wanna have as many light angles as possible. We got our lights from our friends over at ScanGrip helping us out with this project as other projects always. So just make sure that you've got the proper lighting, give yourself different lighting angles because the worst thing that can happen after hours of paint correction making the car look beautiful, and then going to protect it is to leave a high spot, a smudge, and ruin the entire project for yourself. All right guys, like I mentioned, you can never have enough clean towels when you're working with a ceramic coating like this. So I'm just gonna go ahead and hook JC up. 
get some more towels out of here. Uh, we like using, this is our favorite towel. We work with, uh, we sell this uh, white, real kind of real simple microfiber, edgeless towel, uh, dual pile. So we've got a nice, uh, more plushy side, a flatter side to it, to the back side of it. Um, we just like that they're white. There's no dyes in them. They seem to react well to all the coatings. So when you're coating, don't count your towels. All right guys, so we're on the home stretch. We're down to the last side of the top here. JC's gonna apply to the back side of this quarter panel. Uh, once we get it on there, we just got the door uh, and we'll be done with this uh, coating application. Um, again, a little bit warmer weather, but the humidity is fine. So we're not seeing it flash too crazy. Uh, so keep an eye, you can get a closer look up to see how this application is going uh, and how JC's taking the approach of getting the product onto the panel spreading it, and then buffing it in. All right, guys, and we've switched over, uh, especially JC here loves these uh, microfiber applicators. We get these from SM Arnold. It's what we're using to apply our coatings. With this hotter weather, you'll notice that Jay's already switched to a new applicator. We don't want any, any drying, any curing on this applicator to affect the rest of the application on the, on the rest of the panels on the vehicle. So again, don't count your towels, don't count your applicators. If you're gonna do a project and you're gonna start on there, make sure you have enough, no matter what. If for an emergency, you gotta have enough towels, you gotta have enough applicators. Don't find yourself coming up short.